I often tell my students that most declarer plays are a is a tale of two halves. And this is a fine example. Our first half will be to draw trumps, and then we'll get our second suit going, that suit in that dummy, the lovely five card heart suit. As long as the hearts break no worse than 4-2, which is good odds, then we should be able to establish the heart suit. We also at trick one have to be aware of our entries. Well, I've got the ace, ten of diamonds in the dummy, one heart trick, king, king of diamonds, and hopefully the queen of clubs. So we must win the first trick in our hand with the ace, conserving that king of diamonds as an entry, and swiftly start to draw trumps, making sure that we win the third trick in our hand so that we can lead up towards the hearts. We now lead a heart, and East takes his ace straight away. Maybe he shouldn't have taken his ace, but he did. He now gets off lead with a club. And we put the king on, wanting West to play the ace. So West now wins the ace and gets off lead with a second diamond, taking out our entry. Not to worry, we've still got time. We can play the queen of hearts. and Hopefully, if East has got the jack, we'll be able to do a roughing finesse. And even if it is, even if West has the jack, we will set the hearts up in the dummy. So with all this in mind, we'll play the queen of hearts, play the ten of hearts, and let it run. Oh, that's good. East must have the jack. Don't know why he didn't take it then. We'll now play the nine of hearts. He takes his jack and we can trump. Can we get to the dummy to enjoy that seven of the, the established seven hearts? Yes, we can with a club. And now play the established heart and we'll get the last trick, the king of spades. We eventually made actually three trumps, one heart, one heart roughed, a second heart roughed, two diamonds and one club, bringing home 11 tricks.